So the first round of our orphans are growing up fast and a lot of them now are very close to weaning age. This is Mr. Sooty and he's, um, he's just on 10 weeks so it won't be long before he's fully weaned and the dummy has to go I'm afraid darling. And he'll be um, probably within the week over in the main flight aviary so he can get to know bats of his own age and learn the lingo and um, get taught some very valuable lessons which he may or may not enjoy from the adult girls in rehab. So as these bats mature and are sent off to crash for release there'll be a couple more waves of, of orphans if somebody's waiting for their bottle. Um, another couple of waves probably of, of orphans before we get to um, the end of the season. You can open your beautiful eyes and show people how lovely you are, you sweetie. Yeah, so it's a worrying time for everybody because there's so much habitat destruction occurring in southeast Queensland. Fortunately for us, we haven't been affected by fires. But um, at this point anyway, but we're only the start of summer. Isn't that right, Don? Look at those feet. God, I love their feet. Look at those feet. Beautiful things. They're so soft. Anyway, getting off feet. Yeah, so we've got them ranging from three week olds now to about ten week olds in care. Um, and more will come in as the season progresses, unfortunately, more often. So, yeah. Bit of a grim forecast for flying foxes, as it is, has been for most native species during this dreadful heat heat events and um, the fires but at this point the blacks are doing okay it's uh, the grey-headed flying foxes that are at most concern right now because thousands have perished in New South Wales, Victoria and South Australia could probably be witnessing the death of a species I should think at some point they'll reach um, functional extinction and that will be that but for now we just keep going we plough on and um, do what we can to help He's gone to sleep. Mr. S you've gone to sleep, darling. Yes, you pretty much have. Do you mean that dum-dum? Yeah, that dum-dum's got to go pretty soon. 